which has the same issue hey guys welcome back and in this video today i'm going to be sharing with you my huda beauty lip products i don't have that many but i feel like these are most suited for my complexion so if you are of a similar complexion this video might be helpful to you and i also have a variety of lip glosses liquid lipsticks lip liners and also lipsticks so if you are also wanting to know the different type of formulas keep on watching first up we have the liquid lipsticks and these are my favorite three shades i bought these on rotation so here are bombshell trendsetter and also sugar boo sugar boo is my recent purchase and i love it and i'll show you guys why i highly recommend all three of these shades to anybody who have similar complexion to myself or even deeper Touch them all on my hands so you have an understanding so this is the perfect new shade i really wanted something that didn't have any pink or red undertones and this is the perfect nude shade can you guys see i love wearing this with a deeper brown lip liner and it looks really really nice next we have the shade bombshell and this has a slightly pink undertone as you can see and lastly we have the shade trendsetter in the liquid lipstick it is a more darker brown and i'll wear this quite often liquid lipsticks are perfect for anyone who likes matte formulas and also want their lipsticks to be long lasting but these are going to be drying so you need to make sure your lips are well prepped prior to application but if you don't like the feeling of matte lipsticks then maybe pass out on these they do apply very wet and you do have to wait a few minutes for it to dry so keep that in mind i love these formula because i do love matte lipsticks however i also got two of these matte lipsticks in this bullet form and these are supposed to be more creamy than the liquid lipsticks and i really do like them because they're not as drying as the liquid lipsticks in my opinion and i love the packaging it is magnetic i have this shade game night and i have this beautiful maroon red color in the shade promotion day and i'll swatch these both for you this is the shade promotion day it's such a beautiful deep red color i love this color perfect for winter season right now and this is a beautiful dark brown color let me swatch this one for you so this is game night how deep and rich that brown is i am in love it's so pretty it looks so good during fall in my opinion and this is promotion day if you're not comfortable wearing a full liquid lipstick that is completely matte then definitely give these a go because they are also long lasting and they are matte but they're not as drying and some people do find it a little bit more uncomfortable when they wear liquid lipsticks so if you're more comfortable wearing the traditional lipstick formulas then definitely go for this as you can see the liquid lipstick hasn't even fully dried down so like i was mentioning it does take longer to dry and i've already tried to wipe off this swatch and you can tell how long lasting these are personally i don't really like lip glosses i have so many but i tend to go more towards a matte lip if i had the option but then huda beauty came out with her lip glosses the faux filler lip glosses and i picked up this shade in foxy the marketing of the huda beauty lip gloss really won me over because this lip gloss is marketed to give you that filler lip look and now i have three of the lip glosses i have the shade foxy as i already mentioned i have this new shade called she flirty from the new icy range and i also have this shade in bombshell i'm gonna apply this right now since i don't have any lip glosses on and i love the applicator of this it makes the application so easy it's very pointy so you can get them around your corner of your lips as well and this is in the shade foxy she flirty and i'm gonna swatch this on my hands for you guys it's a beautiful baby pink shade so if you are into more lighter pinks and this is perfect it's a very sheer pink this is the lip gloss in the color bombshell i'm gonna actually swatch it right next to the liquid lipstick that was also called bombshell and see how similar it is so this is the gloss in bombshell and this is the liquid lipstick in bombshell and lastly we have lip liners i love lip liners and as you can see i have a few options here i'm always building up my collection for huda beauty lip liners and these are some of the old shades that they had i'm not sure if she still has them in the lip contours i'm going to go through all of these and show you guys which ones i love this is the first lip liner in the shade vixen it is a beautiful deep burgundy color i actually wear this color with my promotion day lipstick and it looks really nice because it is a deeper burgundy color i have this shade icon and i love this berry color because i do own a lot of lipsticks and during winter i wear this color very very often i have the lip liner in bombshell as well now i have the lipstick lip gloss and also the lip liner in the shade bombshell this lip liner has dried out but it is a very similar color to the actual lipstick but i feel like i usually go for a darker color i don't like having the lip liner exactly matching to the lipstick next we have the lip liner in trendsetter and as you can see look this is what happens to the lip liner and i hate when that happens 
That is the shade Trendsetter. It's my favourite type of brown colour. I might need to repurchase this because this is really annoying me. Colour Gossip Girl and it's completely gone inside. I'm going to try to sharpen it. I've never tried sharpening these lip liners before. The newer formula is a twisted formula but I actually prefer these old sharpening ones because I feel like sometimes when I twist it, it does snap. So that is sharpened. And that is the swatch for Gossip Girl. It's a nice pink colour. This is my favourite shade. It's in the shade Warm Brown. And I actually wore it today. This is the new formula that I mentioned. You just have to twist it. Some people do prefer it. So you don't have to carry a sharpener with you. But I feel like these tend to snap. But this is actually much more creamier than the older formula. And Warm Brown it is the perfect colour. And I'll wear this with nearly every lip combo. I was just talking about lip liner snapping. And this is what happens. Disaster. The whole thing just came out, I'm gonna have to throw this away. And lastly, we have the shade A Trophy Wife, which has the same issue, like it's coming out. I never realized that the old formula is really bad. They shouldn't have used this cream formula. They should have actually just used the normal pencil formula, in my opinion, if they were to make it sharpenable. I managed to get a swatch for you guys. So this is the shade Trophy Wife, it's like a purple color. I'm not sure if Huda Beauty still sells these lip shades. And if she does, hopefully it's not the same sort of packaging because this is awful. The whole thing just broke on me. Quite old school with my lip pencils. I actually prefer the normal sharpened pencils rather than these cream formulas because this is what happens. Now I had to get rid of two of my lip liners. Anyways guys, that was my little collection of my Huda Beauty lip products. Let me know in the comment below. What is your favorite lipstick lip product from Huda Beauty? I would love to know and if you guys did enjoy this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys back next time bye bye